Well, we go to Washington, D.C. for our first story today, where the Kennedy Center honors were handed out yesterday, and uh, the likes of Sting, Lily Tomlin, Tom Hanks, and Al Green were all on hand there to uh, receive the prestigious honor bestowed upon them by President Barack Obama. And there were some great performances as well from Lady Gaga and a host of uh, celebrities, including Jane Lynch and others, on the red carpet. We've got some news for Harry Potter fans because author J.K. Rowling is back with 12 new Harry Potter themed short stories which will be released exclusively on her website Pottermore starting this Friday up until Christmas Eve. There will be 12 new short stories in the run up to Christmas and Pottermore.com launched in 2011 by Rowling as a way of keeping in touch with the Harry Potter readership. And we go to the Maritimes now where Russell Crowe made a stop in Gander, Newfoundland yesterday tweeting out this picture of himself sarcastically saying battling the crowds for my public appearance in Gander, Newfoundland. <laughs> the story here is that apparently his good friend Alan Doyle, the lead singer of Great Big C and uh, Alan Hawko of Republic of Doyle were supposed to meet him at the airport, but they didn't show up. So this uh, started a series of sarcastic tweets to Alan Doyle, uh, but eventually he responded saying, fire up the GTO and we're bringing the fish cakes. Very good stuff there. Russell Crowe, almost a fellow Canadian there with his love of uh, the Maritimes and Alan Doyle. Now you're all caught up in entertainment. Entertainment City is brought to you by Vanilla MasterCard and Vanilla Visa prepaid cards. One card, a million options.